Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. This is the live unboxing of a new Nokia Lumia 1020, which came to me a few days ago, as you most likely saw in the Perillo vlog that was uploaded today. I'm assuming you watched the Perillo vlogs. Is everything okay on your end? You can hear me fine? You can see me fine? Okay, that's enough. Just having fun with y'all, or at least trying to. I mean, what else am I going to do to mix it up in the live stream? Thank you, everybody, for joining me live on YouTube. It's not a Rubik's Cube. It's a Rubik's Cube mug. As I showed everybody in the first Perillo picks, I'm very happy to say that has scored over 2,000 likes this week. Can't wait to do the next one on Monday. The uh, star scores sci-fi spin on Perillo picks. I don't know if it's doing as well, but I'm still a sci-fi fan, so what else am I going to say? Still going to be giving away the Intel SSD in conjunction with Perillo picks. Thank you for participating. More information in that video. And I'm also very happy to say that this video so far, even though we haven't been live on YouTube for much longer than... How long? Just a couple minutes, and we already have 99 likes. That's good. We'll keep doing the live video feed so long as we have 1,000 likes for every one of them. Hang on just a second. Had another speaker on in the background. Do not really care to go into that because I was basically watching this live video feed on a computer screen that has a screensaver running a stock OS X screensaver. So I have three things that came in. I have the... Nokia confidence to get the shot camera grip for the Lumia 1020. This is black. This particular canister, which you saw when the strobe light was going off, with the hashtag Zoom reinvented. So it's like a big... Oh, you know what I should have used for my mug today? Instead of the Rubik's Cube mug, by the way, if you want your own, I'll put the link for you in the video's description. Just click the Amazon link. Uh, is the camera lens mug that I have, since I've got the cam big camera lens. Oh, well. Don't want to have too many lenses spinning around. And then, this is kind of neat, they also sent this. It's a stabilizer. So you could essentially put your uh, Lumia 1020 in there and sandwich it in and then tighten down the clamps and walk around and steady the video shot. Or I suppose you could use any camera or smartphone. Really, really nice with a hashtag switch to Lumia. So check out those hashtags on Twitter. I have to thank Nokia for passing along these devices for me to uncanister, unbox, demo, if you will. There she is in a nice orange box and white, orange and white. Is that the uh, song? Orange and white, orange and white, orange and white. Black and yellow. Black and yellow, black and yellow. I, I knew it was some kind of colors. <laughs> just really wasn't sure which colors it was. Let me go ahead and make sure we've got comments tracking just fine. Hi from Tennessee. Hello, where's the unboxing juice in the cup? Nothing more. <laughs> Sorry about that, Wicket. That was his head, if you heard it ding there. Have the lid. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with that canister. Maybe someone out there wants it. And speaking of what someone else may want, before I uh, get uh, leap into the... Uh, that's all, folks. Da, 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 da. No, just kidding. Uh, we have a giveaway recipient. Uh, last week, uh, I, I mentioned we, we are doing weekly giveaways uh, with hardware or with anything you want to buy on Amazon. If you live in the U.S. or Canada you can participate. Head over to go.tagjag.com slash free points, install it. Make sure you mention which sponsored apps you download and install through your account, as well as your referral code to qualify for next week's giveaway. So hopefully you understand that. I will write out the directions in this video's description. This week's winner, by the way, and you're gonna love this, is someone who's been a part of our community for quite a while, and she goes by the name the Fem Geek, and she said, this is so totally awesome. Thank you for making it possible for us to win such a thing. Basically, you have up to $400 to spend on one item on Amazon. Again, download go.tagjag.com slash free points on your iOS or Android device. Use it, 
Share your referral code in a comment below as well as which sponsored app you downloaded. I use it all the time to generate uh, Amazon gift cards, iTunes gift cards, and tons of apps that would normally cost me money I get for free. So this uh, this girl, uh, the Fem Geek, is choosing to get a Sony NEX 3NL camera, the, the compact interchangeable digital camera that Sony had released. And she'd been waiting for it for a long time, and now she's going to have that opportunity. Thanks again to our sponsor, go.tagjag.com slash free points. Also want to know that that software, uh, they wow. just opened wow. it up. I know, Wicked, I'm getting there. You're just going to hold a grudge for me nailing you with that thing, aren't you? Get over it. <clears throat> This week, they uh, launched international rewards and new rewards for the U.S., so you can now get rewards in the U.K., in Canada, France, and more. Go.tagjag.com slash free points. Congratulations again to the Fem Geek uh, for choosing your, your gift, and if we reach 1,000 likes and enough of you guys keep participating, we'll be able to do a new hard get wear giveaway every single week. See, we do so much more than just live streams around here. Chris can figure out how to open the box. No, not on that end. No on... Okay, there's got to be a way. There's no lip to pull. Ah, there we go. I have to cut it open. Hopefully everybody has been enjoying the swath, the wide swath, is that fair to say, of content we've been creating for you, living far beyond technology, because I'm a geek, and uh, geeks aren't just interested in tech. If so, their life is completely boring. Uh, here we have the instruction manual showing you how to get started quickly. You can learn how to take photos. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, so it just basically explains. Uh, shoot like the pros. Just tap the icon below to access helpful tips and professional advice. Tap what icon? I'm glad you asked. An NFC icon. It's kind of neat how they put that in there. And we have highlighter yellow for our Nokia Lumia 1020. It can wait. Texting and driving, don't do that. You also might not want to text and watch YouTube videos. Or you can if you want. And speaking of, hopefully everybody received the free push notification that came in through the Locker Gnome app, which I hope you've already downloaded on uh, iOS or Android. Uh, we have the product and safety information. We have free 20 by 30 poster coupon. And the sound of blur-free photos. What? Okay, it just this is just explaining. If you hear something moving around inside your Lumia 1020, don't worry. Okay, it's just a warning card saying don't worry. Interesting. So apparently we may hear something happen when we take photos with this thing. The AC adapter for the USB cable. Assumedly a micro USB cable. I'll just check the port here. Yep. On the bottom where you see the speaker. And then on the top, we have the headphone jack on the side, power, volume rocker. Uh, we also have a place for you to use uh, like a camera strap. So it's nice that they put that in there, considering that this isn't so much a, a phone as it is a camera, and it also includes a camera strap. We also have the SIM card ejector. These are always nice to have around. You don't really want to use paper clips because usually uh, they're... Uh, their radius? No, their circumference is too wide. What? What's the full the circle? What's the full circle? That's radius or uh, circumference? I never figured. That. You don't subscribe to this channel for math tips. Uh, that is all we have inside the box. We have now deboxed the box. Useless. Shall we open this, honey? Do you want to open this? Because I don't know if it's going to be that exciting. I got my uh, wife Diana helping me here. Why don't you show them your fingers? Just go ahead and slide in there. There you go. Let's show me. There we go. Okay. Move over. Oh, thank you. Okay, that was great. I had no idea it was going to open that quickly. Uh, so we've got the case ready to go, which will help making a steady shot. It also happens to have a battery life indicator there on the side. What is this, hon? Oh, instructions. Uh, so we will insert this, uh, or insert this into this. We're doing some uh, input-output. No, we're good with the box. Uh Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. I'll give you a kiss. How many other unboxings on YouTube have kisses? I wasn't sure where I was going with that. Yes, another strap. <laughs> so, uh, thank you. Uh, we are going to now move on with our life. 182 likes with 394 people watching. I have no idea how popular 
these devices are. But I can tell you this, of all the Windows phones to get these days, this is number one. Not just because of the screen size, not just because Nokia makes it. Or I'm sorry, it's Nokia. If you listen to some of the videos they produce, Nokia is how you say that, 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 that name, that word. Nokia. And if you keep drinking unboxing juice, it gets funnier and funnier. Uh, this is it as far as the top Windows phone to own today because of the fact that the camera is spec to the gills. In fact, uh, right here uh, on the front, you can see that I, I would say the uh, focal point of this phone, quote unquote, is the camera's lens. Uh, such a massive resolution in terms of megapixels. So, so big uh, that at first I wondered, well, why is it so big? And then I realized, oh yes. So you can take a big snapshot and then zoom in and still have a sharp photo. If you do that with other cameras, you're doing what they would call, what would most likely be termed a digital zoom. So by taking a massive megapixel photo or a massive megapixel video, you can zoom in on any particular part of that video and still maintain a crisp image. So. I, I, at first, I, I wasn't sure, but I, I consider me sold on that idea. I'm sorry, I guess I was holding it upside down, not that I think it would uh, matter too much. Or was I? Okay, this is weird. So the stickers are pointed this way. They're saying, hey, look, there's the ca the camera button, the power, or yeah, the lock button, and the volume button, headphone jack, etc. But the, the wording is upside down, depending on how you hold it. Hey, this is an unboxing, a demo, a first boot. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and it says it can wait. Well, they were talking about texting and driving. I cannot wait to boot this up to try some sample images, which I, yes, will upload to all of my social accounts. So stay tuned to those. Follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Google Plus. Yes, I participate there, even though um, I, I don't know how many of you do. No wonder my office is a mess. Just keep throwing things off. All right, let's go ahead and see if it's got enough juice. Yes, I feel vibration. It is booting up. For the first time, a beautiful boot screen. Not really, it's a standard boot screen with a, a ball logo, with a comb over. A ball with a, a white ball with a comb over logo on the boot screen there. All right, knock ya. If that's not how you say it, then they've been saying it wrong. I don't know what to tell you. And there's no fear, by the way, of losing this phone in the dark. Windows Phone, SIM error. I do not have a SIM in there. Welcome to your Windows Phone. Get started. Choose a language. Uh, we are going to stick with English because that's really the only language I have mastered to this point. Uh, the Windows Phone terms of use. Do you agree? Do you disagree? W what should I do here at this point? I think I'm going to accept it. Uh, how would you like your Windows Phone configured? I'm going to go recommended. I Sure, I'll send you my bug reports. That's fine. Uh, I don't know why it's not allowing me to... Uh, really configure the device such that I can keep the clock updated. My other Windows Phone 8 devices haven't done that, and it's really kind of annoying because I don't have SIM cards in a lot of them. All right, let's see here. I've got to log into my Microsoft account. Honey, do you want to do a song and dance right now so that I can do this without boring everybody? I don't see more dance. Okay, well, that was a fail. Uh, do we see any questions coming in from the community? That doesn't make sense. Well, okay, so it's for video shoots? Uh, comparing video shoots from other devices. Okay, that still didn't make any sense to me. Uh, but that's okay. I, I think what he's saying is that it's a good video shooting phone. Is that a guess? It's so hard to say everything in uh, 300, or 300, <laughs> 140 characters. Oh, apparently I, I this is, I, this is what's stupid about Windows Phone setup, is they don't allow you to connect to the network before you, they ask you to log into the Microsoft account. But then again, I expect a bit of sloppiness in terms of execution when it comes to Microsoft devices. Okay, so it needs a few more minutes to set up the phone. How are we doing on time? I really don't want to go much past 20 minutes because we've now unboxed it. I really want to take a shot. I want to snap a photo. I'm taking a look at the comments here as uh, they've uh, continued to stream in, theoretically. YouTube's jumping all over. What is, is it going? Hey, Chris, no, what? Did I click? I clicked the link to view another video instead of the video that we're doing now.
Give me a second. YouTube comments on live are a little uh, questionable. Uh, I, I'm not I'm not seeing many questions here that are really relevant. Uh, you know, here's the thing. As it's setting up, I know many of you have uh, you know wanted me to do more Windows Phone stuff. You've even asked if I have a Locker Gnome Windows Phone app, and, and we don't. Because honestly, the market's not that big. And that doesn't mean that the platform's bad. It doesn't mean the phones are bad. I mean, the hardware's good. It's just that developers aren't very keen on developing for Windows Phone right now. So uh, while, again, we wait for this to boot up for the first time, let me take off the protective cover there. And... We're going to slide it in to its holster. What would you call this? Oh, it is now finished setting up. That was pretty quick. going to snap. Oh, snaps right in. And we'll hit next. Will it stand on its own? Yeah, look at that. That's kind of neat. It stands on... Why is my nose itch? So who's thinking about me? The uh, phone is ready to go. It's in its holster or its camera steady holder thing. Ah, here we go. Nokia Pro Camera. Full resolution photos, high res zoom, creative control. I love creative control with my camera. I hate when it takes pictures on its own. That upsets me. Maybe I'm the only one. Uh, do we want to open it? Sure, why not? I must have hit the camera button. Skip. I probably shouldn't skip. Location. Uh, I'd rather not. You can't disagree. You have to change that in settings. All right. Uh, all right, honey, you're going to be the first picture here. Hope your hair is good. You're fine. Is it okay? Yeah. Give me a second, guys. I'm taking a picture of my wife. Ah, the flash fired. And, ooh, this is a bad sign, at least as far as something's concerned. Uh, interesting. Let me try it again. I got, I got a bit of flare, guys. I'm not happy about that, especially in relation to the flash. Yeah, look at that. I'm getting some yellowish flare up there as the flash bounces off objects of course you know you should be able to let me, let me take a picture of my wife this way all right nothing in the way i'll have to post these to my facebook page facebook.com slash chris perillo taking the picture again and wow that wacky flare i wonder if it's the case that's in the is it bad is it me it's not you you're brown naturally but it's, it's just casting <laughs> this brown i'm not happy with all right, let's try it again. Uh, the brown is less pronounced, but it's still a flare up top. Okay, uh, well, the camera works. Uh, we'll see how, how it turns out. I will upload those photos uh, to, uh, um, to our uh, Facebook page, facebook.com slash Chris Perillo, and uh, do my best to try to mitigate that flare I'm just not very happy with that. And I'm also not very happy with uh, having the uh, location on. So let me see here. Location settings. I want to turn that off. Press and hold camera. Yeah. Uh... Oh, okay. So it's off. It's off by default. Okay, that makes me happier. So I will uh, upload those photos untouched uh, to uh, the, the, the Facebook pages. That's kind of weird. So uh, curious to know how many people out there are actually using Windows Phone or interested in Windows Phone. I will run this through its paces, uh, just to compare it to my previous uh, go-to uh, Nokia or Windows Phone uh, device. This is the 9, Lumia 928, which we unboxed a few weeks ago, or months ago, really. And it seems that the 1020 is a bit smaller. I would say a lot more svelte, uh, curved edges uh, versus a, not, not really sharp edges, but sharper edges on the 928. Uh, the nine or the 1020 is likely to become my go-to Windows Phone, if only because I know the uh, uh, the uh, well the camera. Assuming I can get a good shot, would work better than a lot of the other Windows Phone cameras that are out there today. Scrolling seems relatively smooth here on the front screen. I learned that there was another setting inside a, a, a deeper part of the the phone the last time i had some issues with uh, it seemed to be stuttering on the 928 and i was told to toggle a particular feature that i'm going to see if i can find it here real quick and then i'll be able to show you on this display and touch there we go so under display and touch and i didn't know about this in the 928 uh, you can turn on sunlight readability and uh, also battery saver brightness and there was also i thought the ability to um 
change the basically the the speed at which the screen would update. Oh, there we go. Touch. Got to get used to the modern interface. Yeah, touch touch sensitivity high. It was on the other one set to normal. So that's something you might want to toggle on your Windows phone. You can toggle it up to high. Uh, glance. So it's either timed or you can turn night mode on or off and then it goes and it loops back to the display options. So if you have some issues seeing some stutter and scrolling on your Windows phone, you may go in and tweak that option if you have it on your Windows phone, if you have a Windows phone at all. Nothing wrong with Windows phone. Uh, I will be taking sample images and potentially even video and posting those throughout the rest of social. So thanks again for uh, coming along to this live unboxing and brief demo. Uh, I'll put a link for my Facebook profile in the... Uh, comments, or not comments, sorry, description below. Participate in this week's giveaway. You can get uh, uh, something on Amazon up to $400 if you're selected by participating. Those rules are in the video's description. Congratulations again to the FemGeek. Uh, thank you again to the sponsor, go.tagjag.com slash free points, which I hope everybody's using, unless you have a Windows phone, in which case you're going to have to wait until they support Windows phone because they don't. I really got to take some photos, so I'm going to go do that. We'll see you later.